So one of the biggest names in PE, Scott Sperling, president of Thomas H. Lee Partners, just finished an exclusive conversation with my colleague Christina Oleshi, our deals reporter. Christina, first of all, congratulations. Great scoop. Nice to have these big names coming in to chat with you. I'm sure you talked about many, many subjects. But of those, I imagine which industries are on his radar screen has to be up there, right, on your e list? Exactly. So Sperling's firm, ha firm has stakes in lots of big name companies, including Duncan Brands, Univision, Clear Channel. So they have a very good pulse on what's going on with the American economy and the American consumer. And one area that he sees as a potential investment opportunity is retail. He thinks there's a recovery in retail, and here's what he had to say about it. One of the things that we've seen in the last three to four months is an affirmation that the operating performance, which we thought was particularly strong over the last 12 months uh, through most of 2011, but where we had the uncertainty of the macroeconomic issues that we were dealing with, and so we, were, we had all pulled back which I think is one of the reasons that the fourth quarter public market performance was uh, problematic uh, in 2011, that now is becoming less of an issue. And I think the con we're getting more comfortable that the consumer uh, is going to be there and is going to be growing in the U U.S. market. And I think, therefore, you're going to see more activity in the retail side in terms of M&A activity, and particularly from the, uh, uh, the perspective of the private equity world. So this was just a, a little bit of our conversation. We spoke about everything ranging from fundraising to politics, so that there's more tomorrow. All right, you said politics. We just had our colleague, Jason Kelly, right here on book writing break, talking about the Romney effect on PE. What did Sperling say, if anything, about that? Well, funny, he did tell me who he's going to support in the next Dang, election. Awesome. Yes, but he did say that actually Romney, the Romney effect on his business is quite considerable. Um, they have to talk to investors that have lots of questions about whether or not this is going to impair their ability to buy companies. Remember, they have to approach small family-owned businesses in parts of America that have never heard of private equity until now. So that creates a, that creates a little bit of a problem for them. Then fundraising from, pub, from public pensions is also an area where they'll have to answer some major questions about why they're paid so much, you know, whether it makes sense. But at the end of the day, he doesn't see the compensation actually changing for private equity executives.